Let's fucking work! It's Brad Crowd here. I know you're five foot seven. Well, guess what? I'm five foot six and a quarter, but I'm ready to protect the short king fucking throne. Rough and motherfucking rowdy. Co powers in this motherfucking Brad. Keep the heat. You'll be hitting the fucking bed after this fight, buddy. Brad, the academic weapon crowd he is on Project Verified, yes, he which is. is a reality show with uh, Brian Chicken Brad, Josh Rip Richards. Humongous numbers. If you haven't watched it, this guy's just a limit. Wait, Jersey I, Jerry is not he's clapping. Yeah, they, aren't we you? Told aren't them they not both to be your guys? No, no. The, the later on fight is both my guys. Oh, this is just one this guy. is just one guy. This is Got my it. guy. Got it. He kind of looks like you if you were in shape. He does. Oh, he does. That, that was unnecessary. No, that's fine. Listen, it's okay. I'm a little overweight. I'm okay with that. I'm, I'm not in good shape. And he's fighting Noah Steel Hands Cole, 20 years old. He's an entrepreneur. He's going to show you what misery of losing looks like. He's sharing a cabin with murder myths. So this was the Noah Cole that we were he talking about before. He's the Jake Paul of R and R. Reality stars are pieces of shit. He's wearing the Apollo Creed trunks. Yep, and a, and a wife beater. Brad is Brad is ready. He is. I mean, look, he looks like he's crazy. What, what right do you now. have for odds on this fight for a knockout, Brad, Jerry? Brad minus two hundred for, for a knockout. knockout. Yes. What round, Jerry? Two. Okay. He is scary looking. He is. He looks locked in. Let's see if that American top team training. There's a chance I met this guy at Syracuse. You probably did, Dave. He was at that bar crawl. Yeah, yeah, all right, met him. Throwing with everything. You could see him holding his breath as he throws the shots. Body work, body work, body work. We got Coach Jerry now. Yep. Now, another Good body shot. shot from Brad. All right, Jerry, all right. <laughs> this guy looks like, um, oh, talking shit. He kind of looks like the guy from Friday Night Lights. Not Tim Riggins. No, come on. Bully mode. The redhead. Oh, gotcha, yes. He so kind of looks like Matt Damon now. Yeah, 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 Matt yeah, yeah. Damon. Yep, he's a good actor. He's a lot he's of He's great, Jesse Plemons. Brad's very composed. He's, he's not letting the, you Well, know, nothing's happened, Jerry. I know, but he's, un, he's you know, got himself under himself. He looks good. He's throwing prison shots. Literally not one punch has landed yet for either side. Three body shots, I counted. They don't mean much in Rough and Rowdy. No, but Apollo Creed hasn't thrown a punch. No. Got to give that round to Jerry's man, the... Auto academic weapon Kraut. Jerry is taking off the headset. <laughs> Screaming at his guy. Screaming instructions. I, I don't want, I mean, this will make me look bad. You know what I mean? Yeah. Jerry promotions. Of course. Well, he won round one. He won round one. That but it, sure. But, and he's going to win round two and round three if the fight output's the same. What are you holding there? The Jersey Jerry so he knows who he's fighting for. Oh. <laughs> we got the Little Mermaid in the ring. Oh, and they just gave it uh, the announcement that what a Jersey Jerry. <laughs> Jersey Jerry promotion. Love the free ad. Yeah. I gotta be honest, so far though, Jerry's giving him a little bang bang. <laughs> with the bang bang stuff. Watch him hit the double fisted. Yeah. So far, Apollo Creed. And he, I'll tell you what, you guys are looking at you he like, knows. He like knows. you're he knows. actually yeah. giving him advice. Yeah. <laughs> like, yup, yup, left, right. So far, there's the first punch thrown in the night by Paul. He nice. missed. Oh, and, he's missing by a mile. And then he ducks quickly when he misses. So far, they're, they're, they're Couple not nice able, shots. To, they're nice not able to separate enough to get punches in. He, he, and, and Apollo throws one punch and then covers up instantly. There has not been one punch landed in this fight. Oh, what was that? Freeze as a Statue of Liberty punch. These guys couldn't hit water. Whoa, Whoa. Jerry, you teach him that I one. taught him that. I taught him that. <laughs> Oh, a big miss. Jerry, up for worst fight of the night so far. This is I, I think the difference. This is Stormtroopers in a shootout. Oh, little shot there. I don't know if it's your guys' fault. There's a lot of dunking and clinching and covering. Apollo doesn't want to get hurt, which is tough. He's fighting not to get hurt. This is Ray Charles. Listen, my guy's up 2 nothing basketball. right now. He's yeah. up 2 nothing right now. That's all I could ask we for. May be ask, they may be asking for refunds at the gate after this fight. This is the three blind mice in a roller derby. It's tough. This is do, one. do you think it's a tough look on a promotion? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. You think so? Yes. Real tough. Yeah. Wow. Absolutely. Even up 2-0, you still think it's a tough look? Yeah. yeah. Wow. The, I mean, you're right. A knockout would make me explode. The fight game, you want... I'd rather have your guy lose an explosive fight. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Now, Project I'm, verified uh, live finale on Thursday, by the way. I'm not... 
convinced it's your guys' fault. I don't know that anybody could look good versus Apollo. Yeah. Yeah, see, we got a misprint. Number 11, who they said is the lead, is hurt. That's uh, Maddie Bath. Maddie Bath. So they did not put up the right name. Dee Dee, I think they said. They said. Is there a Dee Dee? Double D it was, I think. But she's not on the other sheet. Yeah. Yeah, so they, they had the missed scores. We'll make sure we get that sorted out by the end of the night. Uh, oh, it looks like his arm hurts him right now, Apollo. It's a good time for Brad to attack. Now Great one time. punch can change the whole dynamic here. Just one punch is all we need. Can hear a pin yeah. drop. Yeah, we could. Just, we could. Just one. There. Yes, yeah, a free ad for that new Michael Jordan Nike movie. We may get booze very soon. I hope not. Bunch of hair. I hope not. I, I mean, Brad's throwing, though. You know what I mean, Dave? Brad's throwing. Oh, there's the first time we've had some action because Apollo threw. Oh, it just... oh, oh no. he's running. Oh, oh he's... no. Brad's in reverse. To Brad's turn in reverse. Run, Jerry. Looks gassed. Yeah, he's gassed. It's tough, you know? The stand him apart is tough and rough and round. It really is. The adrenaline dump. You wouldn't know because you never fought in it, but it's tough, Dave. Yeah, uh, you look. Booze cascading. This is, this is a tight It Jerry. wasn't the best <laughs> fight for your first promotion. No, it wasn't fight. the best. We got the win, but that's all that matters. But I got to be honest. You've been involved now in two fights in Rough and Rowdy. They both yeah. two of the worst fights we've ever seen yet. You got a chance for redemption later on, though. I do, I do. That's the big promotion. The big one. Brad was a late fill in Jersey Jerry promotion. And the two guys from your town, you just knew that they hated each other. You put that together? Yeah, they just hate each other. I put it together. I said, why not rough and rowdy? Yeah. And do you know where the beef started? Instagram. Gotcha. Instagram Just stories. talking shit back yes. and forth? Yes. Frank, Frank just got out of jail a little while ago, so. We got Frank the next I, I assume the Mets us. blew a lead because he's saying, yeah, saying they lost just like me or something. How are oh, the, the, the Mets won. And the Red Sox blew a lead in the ninth, and I bet him individually. That pisses me off. Let's go to Roan. Unbelievable. Guys, I'm here with the academic weapon. He's getting his mouthpiece out right now. Did your opponent hit you once? I don't know. I think maybe twice. I think it's two times. If that. Barely. I know, I know he's slow. In the in our face off, I smelled cigs on him. I knew he was gonna gas out. Then we sweat to work on him. Hoping for a KO. Hey, still got the win though. It's like a truth.com ad, man. Don't smoke or else you won't be able to win your fight. Say, how does being in a reality show help you prepare for rough and rowdy? It doesn't at all, honestly. Getting kicked off the show just motivated me even more come out here and win tonight. And can you tell me about your relationship with Jersey Jerry? How did he prepare you as a promoter? He prepared me, had me up five in the morning, going to the pool, swimming laps. Then after swimming laps, go to the gym, hit weights, after weights, go to the boxing gym for one session. After that, eat two meals. Then later on, hit another boxing session. Jersey Jerry, let's fucking go. Hell of a regimen by Jersey Jerry. Back to you guys. All right. Robbie Fox here, rough and rowdy commentator and ringside correspondent. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. New videos every week and go to watchrnr.com for the latest info on our upcoming events and how to find out how you could be the next fighter in the rough and rowdy ring.